In San Francisco, well, cost you a little bit more. Starting this summer, the city's going to be extending parking meter hours. Crown Force Gail Ong has the details. I don't like it. And they like to put these uh, eater eateries outside on the curb, taking up half the meters in the city already. And so now you want more. If the city's got to do what it's got to do, I don't see why not. San Franciscans reacting to SFMTA's modernizing parking meter hours plan. Starting this summer, the city will be extending parking meter hours until 10 at night, Monday through Saturday. And on Sundays, hours will be added. It will be between noon and 6 p.m. Yeah, you'd like to get a break from all the costs. So Sunday was nice. The reason for the new hours? We're facing a fiscal cliff. We're, we're looking at $130 million budget deficit. That means without a Without any changes, without any new revenues, that would mean significant cuts to muni service. Hank Wilson is a parking policy manager with SFMTA. While we, of course, understand that nobody likes to pay for something that they used to get for free, meters are there for a reason, and they are the best tool that we have to actually create parking availability to help people who want to come in to our neighborhood commercial districts and shop and spend money. Beginning July 1st, the new hours will go into effect in the Fisherman's Wharf and Dogpatch neighborhoods. Dan Markowski says he avoids driving if possible. I ride the bike most of the time because of it, so just hard to find spots, that's all. That's the hardest part. The plan was encouraged back in February 2020, right before the pandemic. Meantime, SFMTA staff plan to get more feedback from the community. The new plan will be rolled out in six phases to different parts of the city beginning in July. And all meters will be operating under those new hours by December of next year. Reporting from San Francisco, Gail Ong, Ron Fornies.